Hello everyone, my name is Fred Varen with Topline Results and today Cal and I will be going to review how to complete the sales process in CRM from lead to opportunity and quote. That's correct, Fred. Uh, we're going to take a lead and we're going to convert it to an opportunity, an account and a contact in one fell swoop. And then we're going to take that uh, opportunity, we're going to add some products to it, create a quote, and we're just going to close that quote and convert it to an order and complete the sales process. Okay, Cal, so where should we start? Ah, we're going to start in the lead section. So we're going to go up here to sales and we'll see our ribbon drop down and we're going to go over to leads, which is where all of our leads in the database are. And we're going to take a look at Peter Houston. Excellent. And I see that the lead has a process bar and that process bar is defined uh, for the company, helping to be consistent in data entry. You have all the fields you need to track what you need from that lead. That lead may or may not exist. And from here, once we feel that this lead is worth it, uh, we can either, um, well, we can qualify it. Uh, if it's not worth it, we'll, we'll obviously would we'll disqualify it. But let's be positive and qualify that lead. What will now happen is it'll check for duplicates. And uh, uh, since we don't, have a duplicate and we just click on continue and uh, we'll open up an opportunity right away. Now in this opportunity the salesperson will be able to work yet another process which is the sales process. So we've gone from business development to sales now. We will add the estimated close date. We'll add uh, a revenue and then uh, we can scroll down this opportunity if we want and add uh, some products to that opportunity. Now we can do from a list or writing products, we'll choose writing products. And uh, here's where you actually uh, decide what that product will be. It again is not from a list, it's just uh, written down. So um, there you go. Uh, to that now we can uh, generate a quote. If you scroll up further down, you'll see an area where you can add your quote. So you will just do that. He'll um, create that quote with the list of products that I have added. And I can even, uh, if I want to create the report for the quote right here, this will be the quote that will be sent to the customer. So that quote has all the information I need uh, to send to the customer. I can minimize that or close it. And I can now activate my quote. By activating the quote, I'm actually locking it down in the CRM. So no further change can be done. And I always can trust CRM to have the right information about quotes I sent. Here we can create the order because we are winning this quote. And uh, we can, uh, by simply uh, clicking OK here, we would close the opportunity automatically. So uh, I save a lot of steps there because I don't have to go back to the opportunity. I am closing and winning the quote at the same time I'm closing and winning the opportunity, which uh, is a great time saver. And, um, and now I can see this order here that is uh, created. Uh, as you can see, we can also push this to uh, create an invoice. We're not going to go there today, but um, we've completed pretty much our sales process. And uh, this, in, in summary, um, CRM really helps you to move along the sales process here and be successful and fast and not just using your CRM for quotes and contacts, but using your CRM from lead to opportunity to quote. Thank you.